All right, this is a shot of uh, the parking lot. The parking lot is empty. As you can see, the vehicles at the other end are from the administration building of the airport. All right, this is the front entrance. And this is a hallway. All right, this is the main hallway. Going to the first office on the right, which is kept, captioned as number 100. Inside this office, is vending machines that probably were not owned by midair. There's also a couple chairs and a credenza of, or a small writing desk. All right, this is the middle hallway, and I'm walking into Office 104A with Mr. Ed from security. 104A is mostly all cleaned out. Walking into the next room, which besides a couple of water bottles, is all cleaned out. Walking into the next office, it's empty. And the next office has four small desks. Okay. All right, this is the next hallway leading toward more offices. This office is pretty much empty. Next office has two water bottles, one desk, and a roll of paper towels. Next office has a four drawer file cabinet, three chairs, and two desks. Still remaining. All right, the next room was, uh, I believe, HR. It's empty except for a couple of uh, file cabinets. The last office in HR has a chair, a couple pieces of cardboard, and an open front bookcase. Alright, the next area is the main hangar. There is some debris left on the floor several piles in the corner are a couple pieces of contested assets including a landing gear and miscellaneous parts a small pile of debris Still in the hangar, another small pile of debris. There are several chairs, a plastic tarp, some cardboard. This is the tool room. And as you can see, there are several small piles of debris. The tool room itself is relatively empty, exclusive of some cardboard. Still in the hangar, there's a number of older aircraft seating chairs. 
These items are building parts from the heating system, so that would have to remain there. Some more debris. Um, still remaining is a paint booth, freestanding paint booth. Some more small debris. Uh, two engines that were disputed items and two engine stands that were sold to RTG. Uh, behind the paint booth there appears to be uh, some empty cans miscellaneous but I believe they look to be empty for the most part plus a file cabinet empty plastic pails and related this device is part of the air conditioning or heating system so that should remain here but the paint booth still remains in the hangar all right here's a chair and a couple cardboard boxes some rigging straps and miscellaneous all right this is the first floor office area there's a room with one desk next room is empty and the large room has a train a desk Hello. some cardboard some What's that? water jugs a small wood table one roll of paper towels yeah, that's the, HR. the next room is relatively empty just okay. needs to be swept all right this is the garage area there is multiple small piles so of debris three open front cabinets potentially some liquid chemicals miscellaneous fluids an office with three water jugs and a small desk all right this is the access hallway to the main tool room and the tool room appears to be empty mostly all swept there's a hallway with some miscellaneous as well as a desk a small metal stand and miscellaneous debris all right there is a hallway that we can't get in there appears to be a metal rack in there and miscellaneous debris on the floor all right this is a second floor office we have a chair a waste can a couple of brooms the remaining is empty all right this is another room with a small formica actually two formica two formica desks two chairs a trash can walking into the next room one picture on the wall a piece of carpet carpet and a trash can into the next room it is empty okay this is the third floor hallway yeah, mate. main office has very little in it in the hallway by the stairs, go upstairs. but there is a desk a stand and a credenza all right the uh, the I'll last call, room has some yeah, I'll call stands now. miscellaneous wood stands, yeah. some countertops, yeah. 
Tell her, um, and miscellaneous debris. The last tell office her has a wall panel. No later than two, walk out the door. I don't care what Eric says. Nothing else in here. I don't need Very little debris. In here if it's slower than okay. Is there is a small room with a small credenza and some miscellaneous plastic wear. All right, this is the hallway to the reception area. It was the last interior place we did not see yet. There is. Uh, let me brighten this up a little. There's a desk, a file cabinet, some water jugs, very little debris. The next office has basically nothing in it other than a piece of wood, some cardboard. This is the reception hallway, which is empty. The next reception office has a desk in it, basically nothing else, so some minor floor debris. All right, the last interior office has nothing in it other than a couple pieces of miscellaneous. All right, in the uh, storage area you have a, uh, what appears to be a 42 foot flatbed trailer with one engine stand. Next to it is a small four-wheel cart, some yellow racking, and one, two, four engine stands. All right, we have a uh, 2006 Chrysler, one metal truck body, two four-wheel dollies, some wood superstructure, an additional four-wheel dolly, one steel cage with basic scrap, you have a Jeep in relatively poor condition. All right, you have one uh, truck. All right, you have a Mitsubishi Montero Sport. You have a Ford, four-door automobile. You have another automobile, which is a 2006 Chrysler Suburban. You have a Freightliner tandem axle tractor. You have one van style trailer. You have a Ford F700 diesel flatbed. You have some general debris. This appears to be diesel fuel. You have miscellaneous metal racks, stairs, parts, storage units, a toolbox, general debris. You have wooden frames, more yellow stands, miscellaneous aircraft parts, an engine cover. You have miscellaneous parts and a tarp. You have a floor sweeper miscellaneous wood. You have a man lift. Appears to be in 
very rough condition. Unknown materials under a tarp, a ladder, miscellaneous interior parts. Fencing, stands, aircraft parts, more tables and stands. You have a quantity of steel drums and plastic drums. They appear to be empty. You have a 40 foot storage trailer. You have a pallet of oil that remains unopened, RTG asks that we leave it there for their removal. There are a number of waste oil cans. Some appear to have some fluid content. Most are empty. There's a trailer with debris, plastic storage unit with oil pumps. Appears to be office equipment under the tarp more debris and I can't say that I've seen this before in any of the areas in the building. You have four 40 foot storage containers, miscellaneous engine parts, one wood crate with miscellaneous, you have two air a plane heater systems but no portable on trailers, you have a forklift, a large caterpillar forklift, trailer with unknown contents, one metal four wheel rack, miscellaneous parts, one wood structure. You have a four-wheel inventory cart, miscellaneous lockers, rolls of steel cable, an additional four-wheel cart, one large aircraft tug, Two sets of staircases, footnote portable, some wire mesh racking. There's an additional aircraft tug located outside the hangar. Okay, I'm in the southeast part of the airport where the salvage aircraft are. I was just informed that there's debris here too. Uh, here's some aluminum scrap. There's a number of aircraft tires. There's landing gear assemblies. Uh, another brake assembly and a landing gear. More aircraft tires. There's a considerable, considerable amount of aluminum scrap. These are the aircrafts that remain to be salvaged. More aircraft parts, seats, fairing covers, landing gear, engine covers. Another vehicle, looks like scrap, and more scrap aircraft parts.